So just outside at Lillipanta you can see there's quite a lot of customers here. Look how many customers are sat outside here at La Playa Cafe. Super, super busy. Some of the lobsters as well. Tiger prawns. So, so busy. the inside seating area of Pier 8 and out see it's just absolutely loaded with customers super busy super packed out. good evening from Bali Indonesia so it's around 7 30 p.m. I'm here in the Sonora area of Bali and what I'm going to feature in tonight's video for you is a beach walking tour from Semawang to Duyung Beach so these two beach locations here in Sonora is probably my personal favourite area here in Sonora. Um, it's home to a great collection of um, restaurants. There's also some resort hotel accommodation in this section. There won't be too much of that in today's video. I think there's only the intercontinental resort that's going to be in tonight's video. But what you are going to see in tonight's video is a great collection of beachfront um, restaurants here on the beach, uh, two beach locations here in Sonora. So without any further ado, let's go and take a stroll along the beach from Semawang to Duyung beach oh, okay so this is a start point for tonight's video Pantai Semawang otherwise known as Semawang Beach we're gonna just head one um, walk this way to just show you this place here this is a place called Studio de Pantai I've just featured this restaurant in a video it's a very very nice restaurant here very popular with um, Indonesian um, but I can see quite a few uh, Western tourists as well in there now it's a very very nice restaurant here Very nice seating area inside. They usually have live music as well inside here. Very, very beautiful inside here at um, Studio de Pantai. Just for our outside seating area, also has an inside seating area. There's also a seating area upstairs that features a swimming pool. Let's close in on the main foyer, Studio de Pantai. Okay, so just leaving Studio de Pantai, so there's a Pantai Semawang sign again. Next in line we have a place called Avocado Lovers and Friends. What a fabulous name this is. I've never tried this place myself, but it serves my kind of food. All healthy food and drink options, particularly avocado drinks. There's some beautiful um, beanbag seating areas at the front here. Here's the um, specialties on the menu here, the avocado drinks has mango and strawberry drinks also smoothie bowls also some sandwiches ice cream croissants as well it's all there at avocado lovers okay so just continuing on from avocado lovers and friends there now we're going to um be approaching the nest signature spa next on the um, left not sure what this is here <laughs> this is a fabulous spa there's going to be another spa as well as we um, get down further towards the Duyung beach area this is the uh, nest signature spa there some of the fishing boats a little bit of darkness here we'll just shut the camera off till we get to the corner Okay, so just as we get to the corner now, we have a uh, very popular restaurant here called Tapa. As you can see, this is so, so popular. Absolutely full with customers. I've featured this place in a video. It serves fabulous food here. Tapa's a name. Also has an inside seating area as well. There's live music. You can see there's lots and lots of people there. So, so busy. Live music. Super, super busy there at Tapper. 
just going to continue walking along here. Oh, sorry, I just walked past one. We have a place called Karu up in the back here. It's like a clothing shop. Just continue walking now. We'll just get past and then we'll just take one more last look at Taffa. Not easy getting a seat here of an evening time. So just on the left hand side now we're going to cut on the inside we have the Intercontinental Resort. This is going to be the only hotel in tonight's video. So this is the main entrance here to the Intercontinental. Intercontinental Bali Sonor Resort. Your seating area outside, your sun loungers, soft cushion tops. Romantic double um, sun loungers. Swimming pool is actually just up there. And there's, here's the intercontinental uh, restaurant area here. A few customers inside there. People sat outside on the beach also. Little, little candles on there. Just here we have um, Pier 8, it's okay, yeah? Just show you the name, Pier 8. There's the inside seating area of Pier 8. And an outside seating area also. And there's also quite a few um, seating areas here on the beach. So we've got some kind of food or something going on there. Very, very beautiful uh, restaurant, that Pier 8. Right? I think that's connected with the Intercontinental Resort. We just keep walking along the track now. Okay, so just down from the Intercontinental next, we have a place called Sayo. I think that's how you pronounce it. Sayo has a nice outside seating area also, we'll just take you inside as well first. Seating area out here at the front. Beautiful seating area inside there. Have some seating Hello. looking out the windows. Hello, how are you brother? I'm good. How are you brother? Good, good. Just take you to the um, beach seating area now. There's quite a few people here. people there so just here we have a place called summer essentials this is a um, clothing shop some essentials some nice um, ladies and men's clothing in there a little tourist information tour booking office here Next is the um, ne the other uh, Nest Beach. This is the Nest Beach side spa. We've just passed the Nest Beach um, signature spa. This is the most popular, probably one of the best spas in Sonora. This. I'm not going to say the best, but one of the best. It's a very very renowned um, spa. This I have featured it in a video. Some nice seating here on the uh, beach as well. Someone inside having a um, back, back massage by the looks of it there. Next in line, this is a place called Lillipantai. So just outside at Lillipantai, you can see there's quite a lot of customers here. This is my favourite restaurant on the beach. Also have an inside seating area as well at Lillipantai. Nobody's actually sat inside. All the customers are sat outside here. Literally every table full outside here. Has inside seating as well. Oh, there is some customers inside. So there's the name of this restaurant, Lilla Pantai. People on the bicycles, people walking. A little bit of an extension seating area of Lilla Pantai here. 
next we have is Ikea. Nice seating area again here at Ikea. A few customers here again at the front. And inside seating as well at Ikea. This beautiful decoration coming out of the wall there at Ikea. Next is the Barramundi Sonor. It's got like a little um, flea market or something inside here at the Barramundi. Table and a seating area out the front here. Happy hour cocktails, no tax, no service. Happy hour, 10 till 7, buy one get one free. So next coming along the line is a place called Umba. It's empty. Take into consideration it is low season so there's not going to be so many tourists here at the moment and plus we have the um, problem with the um, volcano erupting. Nice seating area inside. Next along the um, line is Bamboo Etrian Bar. It's quite busy here at the Bamboo Etrian Bar. show you the name here. Sitting area inside also. No one's really ever sits inside. They're all usually sat outside here overlooking the ocean because of the nice breeze. It's Bamboo Eatery and Bar. Next is um, Coco Bistro. This is an absolutely fabulous restaurant. Hello, how are you? So, so busy here at Coco Bistro, as always, I've featured this in a video, so it's fabulous food this. Oh, she wants me to show you the fresh seafood as well. Fresh fish there. Some of the lobsters as well. Tiger prawns, wow, very nice. That's squid. Just look how busy it is here at Coco Bistro. Always oh, very, very busy. Hallelujah! <laughs> Just from a singer there, we also have an inside seating area here at Coco Bistro. It's always the busiest out here at the um, front. You can see it's just absolutely loaded with customers. Super busy, super packed there. There's a lunch package. All 89k, all of those. And then we have a breakfast deal here. It's coffee time, tea or coffee. And one of the following. 70k. It's all there at Coco Bistro. See, it's just so so popular this restaurant, particularly in evening time. Next in line is Soraya the Grills. I really see the name there. A few people here sat right close to the ocean. Busy inside there, Soraya the Grills. Just take you and show you some of the menu here at Soraya the Grills. Many nice looking food available there seafood soup, nachos, sweet and sour fish. 
pork ribs, chicken breast, all there at Soraya the grills. Has an inside seating area also. Next in line is a place called Limo Beach Cafe. It's just on the corner here. Has a gelato ice cream here at Limo Beach Cafe. Wow, there's not much left of them. Looks as though uh, it's very popular this with customers. Many different flavours available in there at Limo Beach Cafe. So now we've arrived at Pantai Du Young. All of these restaurants that I've just featured um, from Lilla Pantai are all at um, Du Young Beach location. There's some here at um, Limo Beach Cafe. Create your own smoothie bowl. Gluten free, sugar free, vegan. There's an inside seating area as well at Limo Beach Cafe. A few customers here. Next we have Seagrass by the Beach. This is a two-story restaurant, two-tier. Have an outside seating area here at Seagrass by the Beach. A few customers outside at the front here. Also have some um, bicycle rental. 50k for the day for the bikes, 20k an hour. Bunch of bicycles there. Quite a few people here at um, Seagrass by the Beach. Also has an inside seating area as well. Inside there. So just from the tables there we have some music playing here. So here we have all of our jet skis and um, banana boats and things like that. It's all the water sports. And then next we have La Playa Cafe. It's a very popular restaurant, this. Look how many customers are sat outside here at La Playa Cafe. Super, super busy. Wow. Also quite a few sat, sat inside here at La Playa Cafe as well. Some of the seafood. Have some live music in the back there as well. Super, super busy here at La Playa. Show you the inside here as well. This is where we're going to complete tonight's video. So you can see they've got an extension out to the back here. And there's the player calf. Wow. Okay, so that concludes this evening's video. My night stroll along the beach here in Sonor from Semawang to Do Young Beach. So as you've seen with the camera in tonight's video, you've got a fabulous collection of beachfront restaurants in both Semawang Beach and Do Young Beach locations, the majority of which are at Do Young Beach. There is more available at Semawang Beach if you um, where I started at um, a studio de Pantai and continue uh, um, turn right there and continue walking along the beach, you'll find a, um, another collection of beachfront restaurants also in that direction. Um, however, these these are featured here at Do Young Beach area. That's the most popular um, beach collection, beachfront restaurant collection here in Sonor. You've also got the um, Nest Boutique Spa, the Nest Signature Spa, you had Avocado Lovers, you have um, Bicycle Rental on the beach, um, you've got Water Sports Activities, all in all this, these are two great beach locations here in Sonor. So on that note, hopefully you've enjoyed tonight's video, hope some of you find this video useful and get the opportunity to pay both of these beach locations a visit during your holiday stay here in Sonor and I shall say bye for now.